Question number two. Express 1,728 and 2,025 in terms of their prime factors. Hence, evaluate the cube root of 1,728 divided by the square root of 2,025. So we have 1,728. We express it in terms of the prime factors. We start with 2. When we divide by 2, we get 864. Divide this by 2, we have 432. This is a 3. Let me write it well. So we have 432. Divide by 2, 216. Divide by 2, 108. We divide by 2, we have 54. Divide by 2, 27. 27 is not divisible by 2, so we go to the next prime factor, which is 3. Divide by 3 gives us 9. By 3, we have 3. And lastly, by 3, we have 1. So we can write this as the cube root of 2 power 6 multiplied by 3 power 3. You count the number of 2's. That is the number of times 2 has repeated itself and you find they are 6. So now divide by the prime factors of 2025. And this number is not divisible by 2, so we go to the next prime number, which is 3. By 3, this gives us 675. By 3, it gives us 225. Divide by 3, it gives us 75. We divide by 3, we get 25. 25 is not divisible by 3, so we go to the next prime factor, which is 5. So by 5, we get 5. By 5, we have 1. So this is the square root of 3 raised to 4 multiplied by 5 raised to 2. Now, in the next step, we apply the law of indices, we have 2 raised to 6 multiplied by 3 raised to 3, and this one should be raised to a third. That is the nth root is 3, so we raise by a third, divide by 3 raised to 4 multiplied by 5 raised to 2, and all these should be raised to 1 over 2 to represent the square root. So if we multiply a third by 6 gives us 2, so we have 2 raised to 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by a third will be 1, so it is 3 raised to 1, which is just 3, divide by 4 multiplied by half, which is 2, this one becomes 3 raised to 2, multiplied by 5 raised to 2, 2, which is multiplied by half, to give us 1, so 5 raised to 1. So this one can be written as 2 multiplied by 2, multiplied by 3, over 3 multiplied by 3, multiplied by 5. So by 3, 1, by 3, 1, and our numerator will be 2 multiplied by 2, which is 4, divided by 3 multiplied by 5, which is 15. And that is our final answer.